the Plucker, armed with a pair of the finest steel-tipped tweezers. The Brainiac, hairy in all the right places. His job, to give a score out of 10 for the pain he feels when the hairs are removed from different parts of his flabby body. It's going to be nasty. Brace yourself, please. But fortunately, this Brainiac is quite expendable. Four. Hair covers most of the human body. In primitive man, like this one, its use was for insulation, camouflage and protection. Seven. When it's tweezed out, it'll take within five to eight weeks to grow back. Six. So this Brainiac won't be a baldy for long. So why does it hurt? Five. Well, the surface of the skin is covered with pain receptors, denser in some areas than others. Four. The face has many. Eight. The arms, relatively few. Two. Other places are covered in them. The more receptors... <laughs> Seven. The more pain you feel when the follicle is ripped. The way to avoid it hurting is to stretch the skin tight Two. and grasp the hair close to the skin. This will inhibit the pain receptor. Not an option we're going for right now, though. Armour. Being as we are in the business of causing as much suffering as possible. <laughs> eight. So, the underarm tufts caused a reading of eight, but now it's down to the really delicate zones. Nine. A throbbing nine, then. But what about the nostril? <laughs> I think we've struck a nerve. Ten. Yes, ten. So, lots of ripped out tufts, burning flesh aplenty. After half an hour of hard plucking, it's the nose hair which comes up tops. Ten.